So Cyprus is mulling a plan to tax bank deposits in their country. The breakdown, below 100,000 euros are going to be taxed at 6.75%. Above 100,000 euros, you're taxed at 9.9%. Above 500,000 euros, you're taxed at 15%. The wholesale robbery has caused citizens to rush to get their money out. The response, the banks closed. So how can a government assume that it can get away with this? Because... They assume they can get away with this. While Cypriots can own guns, it's a bear to get them. There is no gun culture there, which then allows the government to wonder of its docile populace, what are they going to do, shoot us? <laughs> well, in America, yes, we will shoot you. <laughs> gun control advocates mock gun owners over their belief that guns protect us from government tyranny. But ask yourself this, what would happen if the government here tried to take over your bank account? War, it would be on. Cyprus just proved that Joe Biden's notion of all you need is a shotgun is deeply flawed. Sadly, though, the steal from the rich mentality is alive and well in America. Remember Occupy Wall Street? Mm -hmm. And how different is the Cyprus solution from the class warfare rhetoric that demands your wealth gets spread around? The defense against this toxic ideology isn't only reason, but it's reason with a rifle. So, yeah, it'll never happen here. And you have the good sense of our founding fathers to thank for it. Yeah. So, Eric, what are the odds of this happening in, in Cy you know, Cyprus? How oh. is this not Robert? I mean, how are they not taking yeah. to the streets and waving oh, their rakes? They will. I think they will. Because remember, <laughs> this vote is supposed to happen either later tonight or tomorrow. So at, at some point, the, the Cy Cypriots? Cypriots. Cypriots. Cypriots will probably go and do what, what all you know, good Europeans do and, and riot in the streets right. when, when, all st when, when stuff happens. So let's point something out, though. Um, Russia has offered maybe to help them out. Yeah. Also, a couple international banks have offered to help them out. And the reason why Cyprus is doing this is because they are out of money. They yeah. can't print their own currency. They're part of the European Euro. Union. Yeah. We can print our own money. That's why it can't happen here. It would be like California saying, screw you guys, we're going to print our own California currency. We right. can't because the feds insure the deposits of California banks. So it probably can't happen here. But I like your analogy of taking your stuff, government taking your stuff. It's just like if they came to take your house, mm -hmm. you better shoot them. Yeah, exactly. And your food. And mm -hmm. your food. Especially your food, Dana. They're going to take no, it. No, but, but <laughs> Russia is going to bail them out in exchange for gas exploration rights. Unbelievable. This is the thing that the Europeans need to figure out. So the EU, the European Union is saying to the Cypriots, this is what you're going to need to do so that we can do this bailout, bail-in type of program for you. So one of the things that they've not done is dealt with their own energy independence there in the country. They could have done pipelines, they could have done their own exploration, and instead they're going to let the Russians come and do it. Mm -hmm. And the Russians are the, are the problem in the first place because they have all these people that put their money in to the banks there uh, from Russia into the Cypriot banks. Their assets are too big, and then they don't pay for the services. So the country is, no wonder it's going broke. Mm -hmm. but the Russians are smart. They're trying to take advantage of the situation. This is not, you know, conduct out of order for them. They're like, we're going to do something for you. You do something for us, kind of like what Trump was saying. If we're going to go and help all these other countries and put troops there and lose American lives, give us some oil. What are we going to get back? It's like a, a business uh, transaction. I'm not saying I admire it, but I'm, I understand it. Best thing about this weekend, I got a little um, cartoon thing, and it had a little leprechaun, and he had, you know, a pot, except there was no gold in it. And they said, oh, Mr. Leprechaun, what happened to your pot of gold? He's like, oh, Obama redistributed it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I thought you were going to say that William Devaney came to get it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Bob, okay, <laughs> there's always this gun control argument in the American media that says, okay, uh, you know, uh, uh, gun advocates always are talking about government tyranny, and that's just some kind of paranoid leftovers. We're in a civilized society now. This could never happen. But all, don't we, can't we just look over at Cyprus and go, no, that's a civilized society, and they're stealing from their people. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah well, first of all, let me make one point about the Russians. The Russians are the largest controllers of natural gas in Europe. They have been shown to use it for political purposes. They've yep. shut off the gas to the Georgians when they need yeah. to do it. And give them any more foothold in natural gas, and you're asking for that much more trouble. One, two, mm -hmm. let's remember that this, this, that Cyprus went through in the, in the 70s, went through a civil war between those who are aligned with the Turks and those who are aligned with the Greeks. Uh, there were a lot of guns there. They still are the eighth largest per, per capita owners of guns, uh, and yet they were, there, a lot of guns were taken away. 
Um, I suspect that uh, there will not be uh, armed warfare over this. It will get bailed out. But uh, the question is, could it happen here? I'm not sure, well, as Eric pointed out, we could always print money. But uh, I just have a very real question about whether citizens can take up guns and uh, take over the country. Can I just point something out? I asked those depositors, those, those uh, Cypriots, wh who would they rather have? Would they rather give their money to the government or would they like the Russians to, ba to, to literally buy their infrastructure and then they're made whole? Sounds like they like the, the Russians better that's than a their better own deal, government. Yeah, it is. It yeah. is. They Which keep is their what money. the Russians want. What, Good. Let them have it. I agree. Yeah. That's what. That's exactly yeah. what they want. It's They're the winner. Deal. They're the Can you winner. imagine if you Bingo worked really Russians. hard your whole life and you put away $50,000? And then all of a sudden they take 6.75. But guess off what? The top. Mattress time, people. And no, no, then but, arm but also, I've been waiting for you to say that all day. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. You want to go to the mattresses? <laughs> yes. Perfect. That's what we're supposed to do. Okay. All right. Sorry about that. I couldn't resist it. <laughs>